What's going on guys? So I got another video for you today. So this is going to be a short one talking about a few things and showing off some of the invention updates. So you saw all the Easter stuff. Uh, so people were wondering if that was it. That's not it. There's a couple other things. I just didn't want to spoil them. So yeah, you, they, they don't, they're not going to be hard to figure out. So that's why I, I, I'm not bothered about telling people early or anything like that. Um, and I don't, I just don't want to spoil anything, but there, there are, there are the things. Don't worry. So, with the invention updates, we actually got two new ones right now. And uh, the first one is the Eternal Luck of the Pugs, which is a Luck of the Pugs and an Eternal Ring combined. So, in order to make this one, you need both of your rings, you need a Luck of the Pugs schematic, and then you need 100,000 Uber components. You use the components on the Luck of the Pugs, and you make an Eternal Luck of the Pugs. So, it gains the teleport function, teleports you to these locations. It has the same stats which is plus six to all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I was just making sure that none of, the, none of the things I'm wearing had stats. Yeah, plus six to all. Um, and then it provides the 15 plus Slayer points. You cannot trade this, and you can't revert it. So this is, if you, if you make this decision, you know, you have to be committed to the fact that it's not tradable. In the future, maybe with this dude or something, I don't know, maybe, there will be a way to reverse it but keep in mind, you know, that, that that's in the future. So um, make it at your own risk. So the next one is the Slurp Juice, which is actually a uh, kind of interesting idea that I came up with. Uh, so basically you need an empty cup, which is in Joe's shop. Uh, 5,000 organic components and 1,000 uber components. Um, there's still time to change these numbers. If you think this might be too overpowered or too underpowered, let me know. Uh, so we'll combine those with that and you make yourself some Slurp Juice. So what Slurp Juice does is it heals you three health with no delay but it does not run out it is infinite except for one thing you have a one in ten chance of accidentally drinking too much and emptying it so it's not completely infinite so let's uh get ourselves real low and i'll kind of show you how that works and again these numbers can be changed you, you do have a little bit of time the update is going to be hopefully coming out tomorrow so you have time to change it did i just kill myself there sort of I don't actually die, but... Alright, so we have 21 health, so you click it. I'm get, I'm gonna assume that that was related to the weirdness of my health. I'm gonna assume that I didn't just do something bad there. Hold on, hold on. Okay, I'm not sure what happened there. My guess is... <coughs> it's because I killed myself. Yeah, okay, there we go. So there you go. You see the win up three... Another three, and you can spam it. You know, it's not; it has no delay. And as you can see, we've actually kept it. So there we go. Oh no, no, we lose one. We lost one. There you saw. You drink too much of the slurp juice. So it's really not meant to be like your main food because obviously it only heals three. You can heal relatively quickly if you are low. We just got it on the first freaking try. That's that's terrible. But uh, yeah, let me know what you guys are thinking about these these new items. I'm actually really happy about the slurp juice. The idea came to me like just randomly in the middle of the night, and I wrote it down, and um, I'm happy with the the logic of it all. If you think it's too overpowered or anything like that, let me know. We can we can adjust that. I don't know why my air conditioner got like super loud all of a sudden. You will probably hear that. I apologize. Anyway, so tomorrow, or actually I guess today, because that's when you're seeing this on Friday at 8 p.m. I'm going to be doing another drunk stream. So we're going to be doing a drunk stream. Hopefully, the event will be released. Um, with the drunk stream, we'll like release the event and then get super drunk and hopefully not have to fix a bunch of things um, and enjoy it and all. So you can expect the event update to be around 8 p.m. If it doesn't happen for whatever reason, if I you know run into issues that I'm you know just uh, if I run into any crazy issues that we just can't fix or something like that, then there could be delays. But expect it to be around tomorrow. And regardless of what happens, we are going to be doing the drunk stream. So hopefully the drug stream will be on the Easter event stuff, and I'll you know talk about things, probably reveal too much information and whatnot. But uh, yeah, I look forward to uh, drinking and having you guys watch. I'm gonna try to set up face cam, um, no promises, but I'm gonna try to find my webcam and then figure out how to set it out all that up. So there might be face cam or not, I don't know. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. See you soon.